Thursday afternoon at WFO, we're just getting everything ramped up for the Labor Day weekend sale. We also are finishing a bunch of rigs up to get out on the trail for the weekend. And I'm just gonna kinda walk you through what we got going on here today. You see these guys are uh, getting ready to hit the trail. All Dana 60s, 110s, 42s with the new 35s. Come on in here, we'll show you the showroom if you've never been to WFO. Just a reminder that all shirts and hats are free shipping for a while, not just for this weekend sale. And you can even sneak in 18%. You get 18% off on the shirts, the hats, stickers, whatever, and free shipping. On the rest of the parts, it's just simply 18% off. So Labor the promo Day. code is Labor Day. So you gotta go online, order online, type in Labor Day. These are some of the things that you'll be able to get. U-bolts, spring plates, all the different shock mounts, flanges for bolting in, ice chest racks, roll cage plates, just little things like axle shims, spring hangers. The, uh, as you look over here, here's some of our steering arms that we have. We now have the full hydro heister arms, the HD style back in stock. We have the HD double arms back in stock. We have plenty of limit straps in stock. And as you look around, this is where it all happens. This is Prescott right over here. He's one of our sales guys. Come on up, he can help you out. There's Danny, do we both? There's, there's Danny, he's on the phone. Um, Obviously, you know, Danny's got the red willies. Diff and covers. Believe it or not, he's not hitting the trail this weekend. <laughs> Danny's been like 19 weekends in a row in the willies, so he's gonna take a break. This is always, this is always a good one right here. That's our barbecue. Great Christmas or birthday gift. Folds up. Comes in a carrying case, folds up to this side, slides under your seat. Carrying case isn't here, but it does come with it. Remember, 18% off this whole entire weekend until Tuesday. Lab use promo code Labor Day. And all apparel is free, so if you're making an order, it, it's free shipping. So if you're making an order, you want to add a t shirt, a sweatshirt, it's still 18% off, and you get it for free shipping, so it's not going to raise your shipping. We'll talk a little bit about. Uh, about this Land Cruiser here, it seems to be FJ40 day. We got four of them here. This is an old vehicle that was done a while ago, but it's a perfect example of our double arms. You see, it still has a steering box. The drag link comes across the front, 7 8 time joints. Tie rod across the back, 7 8 time joints. He's got reed knuckles on this one. And if you sneak under there and look, it's also got PSC hydro assist steering. So this thing's on 40s with the steering box, still drives down the highway smooth, clean doesn't uh, swap up like you're driving your forklift at 60 miles an hour. Um, we don't really show this one very much. Obviously, we showed some videos of Jay flipping it over. He's not that talented of a driver. But uh, <laughs> this is my FJ40. It's, it's like a doorknob. Everybody gets their turn. It's got some old school technology, but it also proves that that stuff still works. It's got a ball joint, high pinion 60 in the front. And it actually has radius arms with our radius arm brackets and bushings. And it does wheel good and it does drive good. And of course it's got a six liter LS, 4L60 Atlas, 42s, race line bead locks, lots of different components. It doesn't look pretty, but it, it gets it on. It's a fun rig to ride. This, this FJ40 is one of my favorites. You've seen pictures and videos of this already. This is uh, Dan's, he's a local guy. And about a month ago, it had stock axles in it. And now it has a Dana 60 front and a 14 bolt rear. And we do narrow axles and build axles here as well. We don't just, you know, bolt parts on. So we took a Chevy 60, narrowed the long side down to fit the Land Cruiser leaf spring width. So it's got a Chevy 60, chrome alloy axles. We sell all Yukon axles. This thing has 35s flying outers, and the rear end is a cabin chassis 14 bolt, so when you narrow the long side for a Cruiser or a CJ, the cabin chassis 14 bolts the same width. 63 in the rear, ends up about 65 in the front. Makes a perfect package. So Alan built these axles over in the diff shop. If you walk around to the back of this thing, we did a dual triangulated four length when we put it together. Want to keep it simple but effective. So it's our 14 bolt truss, 
there's not a lot of room to fit shocks on an FJ40. So we ran the shocks off the back, hung the mounts down, protected them with our heavy duty shock mounts with the skids, got our dip cover on it. It has two inch quarter wall lower lengths with the inch and a quarter himes. And then the uppers are inch and a half quarter wall with seven eighths himes. Miss Lima Spacers, as you can see, we kept regular TJ coils in the rear of this thing and they're captured on top and bottom, so it helps you not have to have a sway bar. This rig actually drives handles and wheels really, really nice. And it's totally simple, just polyurethane bumps inside captured coils, 14 bolt with regular old disc brakes, nothing fancy. Uh, I believe he has a Detroit in the rear and an ARB in the front, I can't remember. 40 inch middos. This, and Dan gets this thing out all the time. He's always on the trail with it. So if he's coming to pick this up, he's going to hit the trail this weekend. Let's go look at this one down here. Here's a little bit newer style. So this is an LJ. So this LJ has a lot of our components on it as well. Once again, it's got 41 inch radials, so it can drive good on the highway. But if you take a look, this is our TJ, TJ Kingpin Dana 60 front truss and link kit using the standard coils on a, on a TJ LJ. And that you can buy this kit 18% off. It bolts onto an 80 through 91 Kingpin Dana 60, or welds on, I should say. And we usually do it with just crossover steering. So if you look, it's got one HD crossover steering arm, and then the tie rods just flip to the top of the knuckles. Uh, and the 60 is full width. So once again, it's an 80 through 91 Kingpin Dana 60 full width LJ TJ. One of the cool things about this setup too is this is our TJLJ track bar bracket. As you know, the stock brackets break off all the time. So it puts it in double shear and it's still super low. So you, you got a lot of up travel. One of our uh, customers, J Lo, has a yellow TJ. He just got finished the same setup on his. Saw him last weekend at Sierra Tech. Coming farther down the line, this one doesn't have a lot of our stuff on it, but it does have our full hydro HD high steer arms from about 10 years ago, you can see they aren't even adjustable yet. It had shims in it. It's always good to get somebody's rig back to tweak on a little bit. This one's actually a nice rig and it's gonna hit the trail this weekend. It's got 42 inch IROC. It's a stretch CJ7. And uh, full four seater back seat for the kids. Once again, triangulated four length with captured coils. And we do sell those coil buckets and brackets as well. 18% so we'll off. 18% off this weekend. All the way until, what is it, Tuesday night? Tuesday. So Tuesday, Tuesday night, night at midnight. So if you are already headed out on your, your weekend and you don't have time to buy parts, you can come home on Monday night, hungover, or however you spend your weekend, and go online and order some parts. If for some reason you can't find them online, send an email to us, and we may have them for the sale as well and still carry the sale next week for you. But the code is Labor Day, 18% off, Remember that all apparel is free shipping and you get 18% off. There's no reason not to be rocking a WFO sweatshirt, hat, whatever. Throw it in the we box. Got snap back, flat bills. We got regular old guy round Wind, fit hats. Windshield stickers. Windshield stickers. Koozies. Trucker hats, which actually have the new logo on it now. So come on in here, show you what's going on in the shop. Mitch is right here. He's building the roll cage for this really clean CJ5. And as you can see, he's tying it into the frame right now. Whenever you do a roll cage, it's always a good idea to tie it into the frame. And he's also going to add an overhead console. So if you zoom in up here, you can see if the tube is notched out so we can get the wiring up there as he starts to build the console. Rocking the, rocking the. What's going on in here? Sorry about that. Kevin's over there working on the plasma cutter. There's no time for stopping. Everybody's working. We got to get out of here. I know you guys are probably leaving early for Labor Day, but they got to work tomorrow too. This is a brand new 2018 JK. We're just finishing up. It has a Synergy long arm kit with Ultimate 60s. It's got a Hutchinson double B lock DOT approved. 40 inch tires. This thing should be done, uh, I think, tomorrow afternoon. I'm just putting drive lines in it and stuff and getting it ready to roll. Look over here, this is the full-on sleeper. Doug's just getting the exhaust system back in. 
This thing has a cam 6 liter LS. We just finally started it up this morning after a long time getting the motor dialed in and putting automatic in it. Speak over here. Check this out. This Gavin over here, Gavin's just laying it down. He sits in that booth and welds all day long. And as you can see over here, throwing down some good beads. He's lucky it's starting to cool off here. It was 106 in the shop. Now I think we're 80 degrees. They should be paying me to work here now. <laughs> Keep moving over here. This, this is a cool project we're working on. It's kind of hard to see. Sneak in. So that is a Banks V6 turbo diesel and it's made to do a 6L90E and an Atlas. This is a custom frame from Throttle Down. And this, this is gonna end up as a stretch scrambler. And this project is gonna be a fun project. We're basically just in the mock-up stages of it right now. Pan over here, plasma cutter sitting there. We got the ROP kid is over here grinding parts. He's grinding up all these shackle flips. We want to make sure we have plenty of shackle flips in stock. A little noisy in here. Need axles? Yeah. If, anybody, if anybody's looking for core axles, use axles, or wants us to build axles for them, we keep a ton of axles in stock. You got a lot of axles. <laughs> This is one of my favorite tools in the shop. We can at least talk about this. So this, this is electric over hydraulic. Of course, you guys turned off. Oh well. Uh, press brake. The thing works killer. Found that press on Craigslist. Twenty-five hundred bucks. It's awesome. Um, let's come over here. One of the tools, one of the tools we like to use is our tube roller right here. So you can make radius roll bars or anything like that. As you come back here, still, still really noisy. This is the new programmable vendor that we got. This is an awesome tool. So you can reproduce your drag links, and track bars, and stuff like that for the kit. This is how we notch tube. It's a belt tube knocker. And then uh, look down here, just lots and lots of parts storage. So as far as all those kits that we got available on the website and parts and pieces, these are some of the products that you can buy. Remember, Labor Day sale, code is Labor Day, 18% off. And if you want to buy shirts and hats, the apparel, all apparel is free shipping, and you get 18% off. There's no you can't, reason not can't to have beat a, that. You cannot no reason beat not that. to have a hat, a sweatshirt, you know, whatever. Some link mounts. These are shackle flip kits for all the different years. Frame plates. Great place for Toyotas, FJs, uh, all the different years of Chevy IFS trucks for doing solid axle conversion. We're gonna get out of here. Air compressor's on, it's getting noisy. Look at that. Let's see. Labor Day sale, 18% off, guys. Take advantage of it. Remember, if you can't. If if you can't buy anything before you leave for the weekend, come back Monday night and do it Monday night. The sale goes till midnight on Tuesday. We'll walk over to the other shop. We've got two shops here. This is one of the Jeeps that we're working with Starwood to build and sell out here in California. Just remind everybody, you can buy this Jeep. This is a brand new 2017 JK Mopar or a Dana Spicer Ultimate 60s, 538 gears. 40 inch tires, method B box, PSC hydro assist, poison spider tube fenders, rock siders, bumpers. This thing is ready to go, ready to hit the Rubicon. And if you're looking for a new Jeep, want to sell your old one, make a down payment on this and finance the whole thing, this thing is sweet. The golden black just pops. This is another one of the Jeeps that we're selling. This is a brand new 2017 JK as well. This has Starwood Signature Series coating. They sent it out here as it is, and we fully built it up. And Synergy long arm, 37s, standard method wheels, box adjustable shocks. It's fully loaded. Backup camera, everything you need. LED lights everywhere. This one is also for sale, same thing. You can 
sell your old Jeep, finance the rest, and fully finance a brand new Jeep. You can give us a call, let us know if you're interested in that. So kind of walk over here. So this is the gear and axle shop, and also the you know, it's where we store more of our parts and where all the shipping and receiving is. We're kind of tight here. We're spread out all over in this complex. But we'll come check this. So this is where all the parts come in. You can see boxes of parts. We sell Yukon gear and axle. If you want chromoly axle shafts, we can set you up with all your chromoly axles. Uh, Alan does all the different kinds of ring opinions, whatever you're basically looking for. We try and do uh, three or four vehicles a day in and out of the diff shop. And I think today alone, he's gonna turn four vehicles in and out with full rear end rebuilds, gear installs. He does axle narrowing, um, fixturing, anything you're looking for. So here's Brad over here. He's trying to get caught up right now because he knows when he gets back on Monday, he's gonna have a lot of run Tuesday. He's gonna have a lot of parts to ship out. So. These are the orders so far going out today, right here. That's the U.S. mail stuff, and then he's just starting on UPS, loading it up. Here's, here's his production line, got all the pick tickets. He's just boxing, shipping, stapling. Fastest what, shipping in the off-road market. If we have it in stock, we usually ship that day. So, and if we don't have it in stock, we'll tell you. We're not going to let you make the order and then tell you it's not in stock. So sometimes it's frustrating to make the order, go to make an order online, and it says we're out of stock. Well, I'd rather let you know it's out of stock than sell the part anyway, and then call you and say, eh, it's going to be three weeks. So we try not to let that happen. It has happened before, but everything that's available online is also available to ship out ASAP. And if he's totally slammed, it might take one or two days on Tuesday just because of the sale. Remember, Labor Day weekend sale, the code is Labor Day to get 18% off online. Sweating? Sweating. He ain't sweating, he ain't working. What are you shipping here? Uh, we got a front box drop for a CJ. About our U-bolt and plate kits is all of our U-bolts are coated nice. They're not just bare steel. And then all the spring plates are also coated. So all you guys uh, back east and in lots of mud and water and stuff, they're not gonna rust on you. And then uh, same thing with the steering arms. So like I told you, 18% off code is Labor Day. So these are some of the arms we looked at over there. This is the rear facing double arm. And as you can see, it's got six studs. So basically if you have a reed knuckle, you can still get the five holes when you put this one on backwards. And the matching arm to that would be this. So it goes this direction. If you're sitting in the driver's seat, passenger side, steers across the front, tie rod in the back. These are plated as well, so they're not going to rust. You don't have to paint them. We have about, looks like 30 sets of these available. This is the HD double arm. We can do these with three quarter holes for high joint, drag link paper for Chevy, tie rod paper for Chevy, or any any application. You can do high joints in the back for the tie rods, in the front drag link. One of the other arms that I really like that's popular, these are the full hydro steering arms, and these would go this way. So they have Ackerman angle built into them, that's why the right isn't the same as the left, so you can get the best steering geometry. They, the holes in here are threaded, we figure you're going to use 3 quarter or 7 eighths time joints, so you tighten a 3 quarter 16 bolt through the threads, put a nut on the back as a jam nut so it's kind of double held together. You can go on top of the arm, under the arm. We like to use 7 8 3 quarter heim joints because they're stronger for the double ended ram. Um, these arms are very popular. The length on them is about 7 and a quarter center kingpin to center pole, which means if you have an 8 inch double ended ram, you can get full steering without doing a, uh, a limit on it and be able to not have to take your ram apart and limit the ram. You work your way down here, there's a lot of other steering arms, like the HD crossover steering arm. That's that this is a common one. So if you just got a Dana 60 Kingpin, you're gonna do crossover steering, big tall truck. This is the way to go. It's time to do it this weekend guys. Get the sale. Get the get the sale. Right here the whole 
everything in inventory. We are locked, loaded, and ready to go. Our shipping guy is slammed right now, but we got a lot more to go. Let's keep it going. Inside the gear shop. Okay. I'll move in a second. All right, I'm back. I had to talk to you guys. So these are these are all the king coilovers that we keep in stock for the solid axle kits. So we like to get, keep uh, eight inch travel, ten inch travel, and twelve inch travel for the solid axle kits that we have in stock. If you buy a kit, you can get the chuck. Unfortunately, these are not going to be 18% off on the sale. There's just not enough money in them. But they are in stock, ready to go. If you buy your solid axle kit, get the 18% off. Labor Day is the code. Then we have the shocks too to finish the job. As you work down here, these are uh, these are the boxes for the solid axle kits. The, the 03 to 10 ones are in stock, ready to go. Unfortunately. 11 and up is still not ready. I don't want to put a date on it. We're, we're close. We're close, yeah. guys. Truck driving. We thought we were going to have it for this sale, but we're working on the rear cone rings again, making a change on it. We're that close to those kids. All the parts are here ready to go. I just need to make a couple changes and ready, ready to sell. So right now we're in Alan's gift shop. And you can see there's some finished axles. That's a good looking axle. This is a nice axle. This is Chevy 60. Got uh, RCBs, reed C's, reed apples. It actually has all our double arms on it if you sneak up in there and look. Oh, yeah. And Alan just fully rebuilt this ARB locker, 538 gears. This one's just about ready to get into a rig. And then you, go, you come down and you look at this one. If you notice, it's only four lug. I think this is for a Datsun 240Z that they're going to put a live axle in. Super narrow, posi 373s. So we also, Alan also builds a lot of hot rod axles, car stuff. Um, you look up on his rack, these are all getting ready to be built. And then come on over here. Here's one that just got the purchase stripped off and he's going to clean it up and install gears and a locker in this. This is a late model 14 bolt. So it's Being time to. In California, we can't wash anything outside, no grease, no dirt. So this is the axle hot tank. You stand an axle up in here, spin it, hot water pressure. That's the axle washer? Cleans up all the housings. Yeah. And then, uh, remember I said we got chromatic shafts in stock. So it's a little tight here, but if you look in, these are. Uh, Chevy 35 spline outers, chrome Ollie, Ford 35 spline outers, chrome Ollie. We have 78, 79 Ford inners, Dana 60, 80 through 91 Ford inners, Dana 60, Chevy, Dana 60, the lifetime warranty, Yukon shafts are what we're selling. And then we keep all the flange floater shafts, 35 spline, stuff like that. All the spice we use are need to. Remember, Labor Day weekend sale, the code is Labor Day to get 18% off. This is so cool. These are, uh, these are Brendan Thompson's third members, and this is a dropout 14 bolt, and he drives like an animal. So, if you look through here, that would be a 14 bolt completely stripped. And Brendan's usually good for maybe one, two races, and now that he's got the uh, big motor in that thing, if he doesn't lift when he comes down, here's the problem. Well, that one's got to fix that for him. This is front end right here. This is uh, about the only thing that the 97 to 04 shoe through the axle is good for. We're pressing the axle tube out, pressing in a new tube, and building a custom front end with all the outers with this high pinion 60 front end. This is our uh, Super Duty crossover steering setup that we use on the solid axle kits. So this is the reed knuckle with our crossover steering arm. and. On this one, we are coming from the bottom up because the truck isn't too tall. It's on a six inch kit. So he's kind of mocking that up. Keep in mind that we are now uh, direct with ARB. So if you have any locker issues, uh, looking to get fridges, anything like that, we have all those parts as well. Uh, come over here. This is, we're selling a full solid axle kit for an 07 Duramax. 
and this is one of our core axles that we strip down. We're gearing it, cleaning it, putting all the right brackets on, rebuilding it, putting it back together. This is going to go out next week with the customer solid axle kit. One of the really cool things is these are the 1550 Spicer axle shafts and U-joints that are going into this axle. So the new Super Duty 60s 05 and up, you can buy these axle shaft kits and get the 1550. This is way bigger than the 1550. And it's OEM Spicer stuff. So this is, this is our guy Doobie. His name really is Doobie. Uh, and no, he's not allowed to do that at work. What he does at home is his own deal. It's California. So he is... What are you doing over there, Doobie? Ball joints. You got ball joints. So we're doing the 09 and up steering box upgrade on this truck, which is a much bigger steering box. Then he's getting a new tie rod, new drag link, new ball joints, new U joints. Basically, this is just a full rebuild on the tow rig. And Alan does a lot of this over in the dip shop. A lot of people don't realize we just do in and out dip service. So, as we walk back out, remember, if you're looking for parts over the weekend, 18% off. The code is Labor Day. And if you want shirts, if you want shirts, hats, stickers, not only is it free shipping on the apparel, but it's also 18% off if you use the code Labor Day. So there's no reason you shouldn't have a hat, sweatshirt, whatever. As you can see, Brad's already backed up, boxing up parts just from what got ordered today. So hopefully, if you've been waiting for that big part, you can utilize this 18% off. Time is now. I don't know, uh, I don't know if there's really anything else to talk about, but as you can see, we are stocked up. We got a ton of Jeeps just getting ready to leave the truck. And if you don't feel like building one, you can just buy one. They're ready to go. Two Jeeps sitting right here. I guess that's it. Remember, if you're out there wheeling this weekend, I don't care if you're pulling it off the trailer, put your seatbelt on. We've had some issues. We've lost some people in the last few months. It's simple. Wear your seatbelt. Go have a good time. Get crazy. Send us the videos if you do something stupid. I'd like to see that, you know, roll over, break stuff. We want you to break your stuff, and then I'll give you a good deal on it.